Did you guys peek at the questions? What questions? Oh, there are questions. Get! Go! Ruby, Molly, I mean, you guys are not in the Q&A. I'm so get. sorry. Don't go lay down. Don't bang the camera. Oh, go lay down. down. Ruby, go, go lay, lay down. down. All right. We are about to start. Sophia's right where she lays down. I'm going to ask oh, a bunch of questions. Phone is jabbing me. I read some of these. I read some of these in the car, and I was like, "Whoa, our subscribers are really on on the ball I with our that. questions." It looks like I have no. I have Daisy Scott, except for the little straps. Yeah, don't do that. People be thinking you're naked. Oh my gosh, you do look that much better. Usually, we have like a nice Christmas blanket, a nice blanket on us. Uh, you guys can't see behind the camera, but we're covered in dogs and dog toys because if you sit somewhere, then the dog always brings you a toy. Or a okay. dog toy sitting on you. No. All right, so are you guys ready? That's Oh. Run. <gasps> okay. My mom just wants to say. 359. Oh, that's what that was for. Yeah, okay, so. The top one. Mm hmm. Okay, so let's get started. So we're going to say 3, 2, 1. Hi. Uh, hey guys. 3, 2, 1. Hey Hi. guys. Welcome back to our channel. Today's extra video is a Q&A. It is your assumptions about us. This, this is the juiciest of the juicy Q&A videos. You guys rose to the occasion. We asked you guys to, I asked you guys to post assumptions about us on Instagram. 359 assumptions. Okay, so at number oh, one. that's terrifying. Ellie Spadell says Gabby doesn't like Riding Storm anymore. I know it's true, Gabby. He's riding Storm? Riding Storm. No, I like him. He's really smooth. Especially for no She knows really bouncy and Storm's really smooth, except for when he jumps, because when he lands, he rocket launches you. Molly, stop it. He rocket launches you when you land, but I still like riding him. It's yeah. really easy to frame. Yeah, she's always going to love Storm. Storm is home to her. Okay, so a day by day vlog dot edits underscore says you're going to st sell Storm. Says that nope. you're going to sell Storm eventually. Nope. Come on, Gabby. You all, we all know it. I mean, we don't need him. You're going to sell him. No, we are not selling Storm. Storm is a part of our heart. Her heart, my heart, her heart, even Sam's heart. Yeah, they bond. And Kaylee's heart. They bonded while walking to the field while she was here all summer long. So day by day vlogs dot edit the underscore again says you don't really like your fans. Okay, I love our fans. I love them. I love all of them. I love all people. I love, I, I believe in people. So Stop I love it. them. As long as they're nice to me, I'm nice back. So yeah. we love them too. She loves to interact. Gabby? Some are just, yeah, annoying. <laughs> Some use me for clout. <laughs> some and some, Molly, down. Some of them, no, I said down. Good girl. Some of them spam me so much that I have to like block them in order to not get the notifications and I need the notifications on because Kaylee texts me a lot on um, Instagram. It's true. I will put up with a lot. Some people put up with a little. Some people put up with nothing. Like if somebody, even if it's out of the kindness so of their I'm heart. I'm Sophie and that's Sophie. Gabby. Gabby doesn't put up with very much. If somebody, even if they're just being kind, spams her or is phoning her all the time and it's like she's in the middle of, of doing something and her phone is just going like crazy, she'll block people. Like it seems mean, but this is an honest Q&A, you guys. Like we gotta be real. Like even though we appreciate you, sometimes there are times that are hard. My dog knows when I snap and go. Okay, listen. So the little question yeah. girl says, you wish you could tell all the Karens that leave horrible comments exactly what you think of them and just tell them to bog off and mind your own business. And for anyone who doesn't understand what Karens is, it's just a British saying. It, it, it is not a British saying. It's everybody saying. It's, it's a, somebody who wants to tell you it's a how to do a, saying. Yeah, tell you to do everything. So, Sophie, do you want to wish you could and tell them? And they're really them? annoying, but the Karens have like the special Karen hairstyle <laughs> and the Karen look and the Karen. All right. My kids are listening to Kids Bop. They can't hear us. Yeah. What's Kids Bop? <laughs> we are not Karen. It's, it's um. It's a music thing that takes music with a lot of swearing and stuff and makes it kid version. Oh, that's super cool. Okay, they so fail that right. You wish you could tell the Karens off. Uh, yes, but yes. they aren't really Karens. Yes. They're just haters that want attention because when you see their profile pic, they do not look like Karens. So they're just haters that want attention. Okay, so they want clout. 
So from it's everybody yeah. telling them off. So. It is definitely, yeah, some people just post hate just to get attention for themselves and draw attention to their channel, draw attention to them. Um, that's why deleting, block, delete, and I believe block, ignore, and delete are your best friends. But it is true. Sometimes when you're see, hearing the same... Someone is jamming music in the car. Sometimes when you're hearing the same information over and over and over again, 500 times, it gets really hard to to handle. But I can usually tell when things are coming from a good spot and that doesn't bother me that much. All right, so day by day underscore lover 17 says you're different off camera. Are you different off camera? How are you different? I talk a lot more. You talk more off camera? Holy heck. Are you different off camera? Yes. How? Are you more outgoing on um, off the camera? Yes. Kaylee has videos on her phone. To prove it, are you more friendly <laughs> off camera? No. Okay. Should have... Uh... Wait, what about you? Oh, I am not. Am I more different? Off, am, am I different off camera? Yeah, like I think we're all different off camera to some degree, Screw but... You. Yeah, like I get them in trouble. Like you guys don't see me get them That's in trouble. That's a Sagittarius thing. Yeah, like I get them in trouble. Like we have, we're strong parents. And we chill. have a lot of, yeah, we have a I'm lot of chill rules. down to earth. You know? <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what that means. <laughs> okay, so yeah, we all are, but for the most part, I, I am who I am, and that's not going to change. I, I don't know how to fake being somebody different on camera. I don't show you guys every single thing that I say and do. I do get them in trouble. I get Sam in trouble, but I love people. I believe in people, and that's not and that's not different off camera or on camera. All right. So Liz Lavoy twenty three says you've been actively looking for a new farm and found one. Your offer was accepted, and you are going to be moving in a couple of months. Christmas surprise. And oddly, nope. that is exactly what I have planned. I don't know if that's gonna work out. But I wish that that would happen. I hope that that happens. Like, that is my dream. My dog's getting a belly rub here for... My dog's getting down. a sleep thing. Um, sleep. Okay, Equine Haley says, You and Sam don't care about horses. As You and Sam don't care about horses as Gabby and Sophie pressured you guys into buying them horses. Then why would you... That's true about Dad. Dad but then he grew to love Storm. Yeah, Sam, Sam helps with the chores. Sam does, and does chores. why would she have a horse? If she yeah, why do I have a horse that I ride all the time if I didn't love them? And um, like, Well, you didn't love them here. at first. So the girls, okay. unlike a lot of people who say that they've been trying to get their parents Down. to buy them a horse for their whole entire lives. Down. We always wanted to buy our, house, our kids a horse. They didn't need to Down. pressure us. Did you need to pressure us to buy a horse? No, we just had to keep looking. We just had to keep looking. We had to wait until the time was right and we had to just Down. keep looking. No. So we, we wanted to buy our kids a horse. Uh, we also believe that you should never buy your kids a pet and expect them to be solely responsible for responsible for it. I don't feel like that ever works out very well. AKA this Except for Molly. Molly turned out pretty well behaved. Yeah, but I mean, no matter what, Molly will always be our family dog, even though she's Gabby's. If Gabby got married and couldn't take the dog, her husband was allergic, if she goes off oh, to school I would take dump him. <laughs> yeah, like, no matter what happens... before then. Yeah, no matter what happens, we are responsible for all of our pets, and we will keep them forever. If we can, barring any kind of natural disaster. Love the fact that she's so emotional that she listens very well. She gets really emotional if you get mad at her. She's like, oh my god. And then she oh pees god. her pants. JMA Equine says that Laura has gotten over her fall off Stella. Confidence wise. I think so. I, I think I got over it. I thought I got over it really well before. But definitely, uh, I mean, I'll always be nervous. A bit nervous, not so much on gated breeds. I feel more confident on them. Day by day vlog dot edits underscore says you're really rich. You're secretly rich. <laughs> I wish. <laughs> we wish. Yeah. No, we well, are. Well, we might be. Dad might secretly be. Yeah, we are. Based off the things he buys. We are us. definitely not rich. Okay, so day by day edits says Sophie loves Finn, but is completely saddened that she's growing out of him. So you are eventually going to have to have Sophie look for another horse and oh sell Oh no, I got Finn. scratches on my Oh no, we're never selling Finn. Finn. Okay, Gabby, we're we're doing okay. She didn't think we're doing the Q and A now. Okay, Sophie, did you hear the question? Oh, we're never selling Finn. Are you sad that you're gonna grow out of Finn? Yes, but we're never selling him. Yeah, we're never selling Finn. 
Okay. The inside, like we never, she ne there's no other horse in the world for her. She just loves him. Is he squirming? Wait, away? I want to see the the fights. There's fights in the comments, you guys. Okay, so day by day edits again. You feel pressure to post and get stressed out very often handling social media, YouTube, the horses, your pets, work, family, and school. So no, mom gets stressed out over horses because she's paranoid. So yep. I don't get, I don't feel pressure to post. I love trip. posting. Oh my god, she's lame. <laughs> <laughs> that happened on the trail. Oh my god, she is lame. Gabby, there's something wrong. Molly, get over here. She's shedding. Come here. Okay, so I don't feel pressure to post. I do not get stressed out handling social media, YouTube, the horses, your pet, family work in a way that I don't get stressed out in a way that I don't want to do it or like I never feel like, oh, I have to go down and take care of the horses today or oh man, I have to post a video today. Like, I, none of that, but I do get overwhelmed if we get a lot of hate. So, and I do feel, and I don't get overwhelmed that we have so much homeschool, YouTube, the horses, the pets, the animals, but it's a lot of work. It's a, so much work. I'm a hyper person, so I don't mind the work and I love the work. And sometimes I do, com I don't complain about the work, but I complain that I feel like sometimes people don't really understand how much we do do so people will complain about something and i think to myself like holy heck we are doing all of these things like we can't be miracle workers so there's a bit of a truth to that and but i don't feel overwhelmed in in the way that i don't want to do it i just feel frustrated when people gang up on me the sound daisy is um daisy <laughs> daisy keeps groaning so equestrian underscore lib says behind the camera you you don't let Gabby give you attitude. Kind of. Absolutely. When the camera is not rolling, there is a lot less sass happening in the day by day house. Sassy Seal says you're mean behind the camera. She is. Yeah. <laughs> Very mean. How am I mean? You yell at us for no for reason. For no reason. <laughs> Alright, so day by day vlog edit says I think Gabby has a boyfriend. Oh. Sophie I think, and I think I she wish. does too. We think she does because today we were all downstairs and she was upstairs supposed to be getting ready and she was talking to someone out loud. I was talking to Molly. Oh. <laughs> yeah. She does talk a lot. I feel like we're on the verge you of the boyfriend game. You can see who I called. Like, I feel like we're on the verge of the boyfriend game. I wish. <laughs> Show us all the people you text. Uh, here's all the people I call that. Mom, dad, mom, dad, Kaylee. Mom, dad, Sophie, Sophie. Kaylee. No, that's all the people because I lose my phone so much. So I'm like, call me. And then I have to pick up or else I get the, the red stuff out of the notifications. Like, you missed a call. You spoil the crap out of your children and only Sophie is appreciative of all she has. Gabby thinks, okay, so let's do that one first. You spoil the crap out of your children and only Sophie is appreciative. So if I um, spoil. Dad? spoils me a lot if I spoil it's your just children it's because I have the charm that I can make them do whatever I want <laughs> mainly him I put something on her butt so basically yeah if spoil means we buy them things because we enjoy buying them things then yep we definitely do that Sophie is the only appreciative one that Sophie's the only appreciative one Sophie does appreciate most things. Gabby totally appreciates most things as well. Gabby thinks she can ride better than anyone else and hates criticism. Gabby, do you think you ride better than everyone? Not everyone. Laura really wants to ride and learn, but often get, turns to Gabby for advice when she should really be looking to an instructor. Okay, so basically... Because I'm, I'm right there and she doesn't have to pay me. Gabby's right there and I was, I'm gladly paying an instructor. I don't have anywhere that I can take a lesson with Penny right now. She is, she isn't trailering right now. I like Brandon will come here and we're working on it, but he works that 17 jobs. Like I can't just do what you and want me to do. Ponies that he needs to train. In our entire YouTube video career, I have never not looked to instructors so for anybody to think that I would not look to an instructor for myself is delusional you can see these he's an expert my dog wants belly rubs my dog wants to sleep horses really aren't Sam's thing but he adores his family and enjoys to enjoy supporting them give me a kiss I don't know if he enjoys supporting us but he does help us and there are a lot of fights in the comments here <laughs> about what Molly is trained to give you kisses Molly come here 
So, listen to this one. You see, you're secretly worried that Penny wasn't the right horse, but can't say anything because Gabby is disapproving of her. Oh my gosh, obviously you don't know me. I can say whatever I feel like. I have no problem admitting when I'm wrong, when I'm right, when I think I'm wrong, when I think I'm right. I think Penny was sent from heaven. I think she's an amazing horse. I think she's exactly what I needed. Sophia feels left out sometimes. No. Um, you spoil your kids and buy them whatever they want. No hate. I'm a big fan. If you if spoil our kids and buy them whatever they want means buy them things because we enjoy buying them things, then yes, we do. Y'all are rich and the girls are low-key spoiled. I'm noticing a trend here. Why are we spoiled? Just because we have I a tree? Am. We are I think it looks like a mistletoe. So, out of all the kids no. that we hang out with, all of them have parents that buy them stuff because they enjoy buying them stuff. Do I buy them stuff every single day? No. I want you to buy it. Yeah, and there are lots of things that my kids want that we don't have. Like a mansion. Sam doesn't like being on camera. Gabby has attitude most of the time and Sophie doesn't want to be mean. Yes. You mm -hmm. nailed it, sister. They don't want to get grounded. You guys don't plan on keeping Chino forever. I think we do, though. What? You mean there's any question? No, because the only way I could get Chino, Brandon would let me get Chino, is if I promised to sell him once I grew out of them. But we're never selling him now. Yeah, I mean, that was just a ploy. We are that was only to get him. Yeah, we are not selling Chino. <laughs> Chino is part of our family. Gabby's going to get another horse, leaving Chino and Storm in the dust. So people get jealous because she only has Finn. Would you be jealous of uh, only having Finn? Would you I be also jealous? have Gracie. No, I, I have Finn. Finn's I, mine. Yeah, I love him. I also own Gracie, too. And I haven't left my, I haven't left my other horses in the dust, so. Yeah, and that's what's weird, too, is like, people assume things about us without remembering what we've already done and judging Finn, us by our actions. Finn hates me right now because he thinks I ride him too much right now. Pen, Penny is not what you thought. Penny is not what I thought. She is so much more than I ever could have dreamed. It actually surprises me that people, that people might think that. You like Sophie better than Gabby. <laughs> Do you think I like you better than Gabby? <laughs> Do you think I like Sophie better than Gabby? No. No. Honestly, no. All of my kids think I love them best. I think that's a joke. But I'm the favorite. Yeah, they rag they, about it. They all think they're the favorite. Even my boys, they all see. I they all think the that they are secretly my favorite. I think that is a job well done. As a, no, as a I'm dad's no, favorite. He, he doesn't hide it. I'm dad's favorite. Sam, is Gabby your favorite child? Oh, he's <laughs> Is Gabby your favorite child? I have no favorites. He has no favorites. You can tell Explain them. everything Gabby he thinks she and lets me get away with. Gabby thinks she controls you. Yeah, I kind of do. Uh -huh. Fiona is not driving my truck and trailer. Can I? Can she? Yeah. Okay, wait, this is a good one. You are secretly... I'm not buying the horse. You're listen, wearing my shirt. Sure. Okay. Okay, listen. Oh, you are secretly broke and constantly taking out loans to pay the bills. Nuh-uh. <laughs> no. We take money out of our bank accounts. To pay for things like lessons because we have to pay in cash. Money. Gabby is older than what she says she is. I am not. <laughs> I was born in 2007. You can do the math. She's only 13. Yeah, that reminds me. You guys remember when we had that stalker from our old barn and she oh was obsessed with the fact that she thought Gabby was older than us? I'm just really tall for my she's age. She's always been. She's actually not tall for her age now. She's 5'5. I, five. I stopped growing though. I grew. Yeah. She I grew. did this thing where I grew before everybody, and then now I've stopped growing. Yeah, that's well, exactly what she did. When she was a baby, she was, I was so that tall much taller than everybody. everybody. And I posted my pictures class. of it. Gabby's sassy, Sophie is super sweet and caring. Yep, not uh, me. <laughs> no. But she's my sister, she annoys me. Okay, everybody get in a little better. Yep, that is true. But Gabby, did, Sophie does have attitude. She's a little bit of sass. <laughs> she... She's easier to, she feels bad though if she's mean. Come on, so get closer to me. She feels bad if she's mean, whereas Gabby doesn't really care that much. Gabby has a crush. I wish. <laughs> you Crystal. guys know that every lesson you shouldn't jump, but you still do and you need more flat work practice. What did we do? 
before. Yes. So we have ridden without jumping, but in where we are with our instructors, that's not how we learn in our area. On you our gotta practice area. to learn something. You yeah. can't just think so, you learned it in your head. I know in some places that's how you ride. We do what our instructors tell us. And that's all I can say. We do what our instructors tell us to do with our horses. I know, you should do that one. Alright, this is a bunch of... Okay, Gabby has a crush. Wish. Kaylee has a secret boyfriend. Nope, not secret. Nope, not secret. You guys are going to get another mini. Yes. Maybe. No. Yes. yes. Sophie and Gabby actually fight quite a bit just off camera. Yeah. They fight on camera. Uh, one of you wants to start doing more Western. Hate Western. Mom does. No, I don't. I don't want to change anything that I do. I want to ride in a saddle that I enjoy riding. Why do I like flat? In this I, shirt? I don't. I don't. I want to be a trail rider. That's what I want to be, and whatever that means is whatever that means. Um. Can Can I choose them? Gabby has a boyfriend. I wish. Gabby doesn't enjoy the vlogs. Do you enjoy the vlogs, Gabby? She loves to watch her I videos know. back after she's been riding and oh, see the no. things. Oh <laughs> <laughs> nope. no. <laughs> Yeah, it's hard to watch when you make mistakes, but I mean, it, we have some really fun days. Like our trail ride video was awesome to watch. We laugh a lot. We watch some videos back again and again, looking back. Gabby has like a much deeper side than some of you guys understand. And she misses Stella. She misses like... Cause Stella's mine. Yeah. Good. And Stella, and I think a part of the reason that she has such a hard time accepting Penny, I mean, she does accept Penny, but she doesn't, hasn't ever bonded with her. And I think a lot of that has to do with the fact. Oh, my dog's shedding. Yeah, Same as mine. I think a lot of that has to do with the fact that she looks like Stella. Like, it was hard for no, me. No, I don't like the gated breed. And she doesn't like the gated thing. And I'm not out to make her be a gated horse person. I couldn't care less. She looks really awkward. Yeah, and people do think that. And I, and I, and that is what, I've talked about that before. Like, people do think that gated horses are awkward. So they do you like are. doing YouTube? Yes. The girls don't like flat work. Hate it. I hate it. Chino hates it when he does too much of it. That's why I can't do flat work for a whole month because I hate it and Chino starts trying to buck me off if we do it. can't believe so many people think that Penny is not what I thought she would be. She's I can't so... believe so many people are spoiled. Yeah, spoiled and Penny's not right for me and Cappy. A brat. <laughs> she is. Gabby has expensive taste and likes following trends. I think the opposite. Gabby, I don't like following trends. I don't really do trends things. Yeah. I just want the Christmas pajamas for you and your dog. That's the trend. Yeah. So right now. So not being. So not going to school eliminates that whole desire to be like your friends. She sees what she likes. Sophie, do you have a love hate relationship with Ben? Right now, yes. He hates you. You love him. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna give Gabby Finn? No. No! We would never do that. No! Your horses take off a lot, but you get them under control easily? No. Storm, no. Chino only has once, but that's because he spooked at enough snow to bury us, falling off the roof beside him. And he could see it happen, because it was at the place where we used to board, like our first boarding place. Finn just starts going faster and faster, but then I can slow down really easy. Aww. What? This one's so nice. You are, really, you are really nice and don't judge other riders. Gabby and Laura are super outgoing, and Sophie and Sam are a little bit more shy, but overall I think you guys are a super nice family and probably one of those families that you love hanging out with. I think Sophie and I are more outgoing. Gabby and I'm Sam are more I'm more shy so until I know you and actually like you. Laura is a messy hair person. Yep, that's true. I am. Yeah, you really are. Thank you. You secretly buy tack without showing us. Nope, never. Nope. No. Unless it's for Christmas and they don't. Gabby and, and Sophie are going to try eventing. Nuh uh. No. Gabby wants a boyfriend. Yes. So, somebody says that you guys are adding ads and videos a lot more now that you're getting more popular to make more money. We, we cannot add ads. We don't get to choose. YouTube yeah, gets to choose. They put them in. They choose when, how often. They they do all of that stuff because they, uh, it is almost Christmas time, so there are more ads to put out right now. So, if you're seeing more ads, then that's why. And I should say, another thing is that there are a lot of channels out there on YouTube that are only making videos for money. And I really honestly hope with all my heart that it's obvious that I care about our channel. I could just put out videos 
and not have a relationship with any of you guys and just be interested in making money but I don't do a lot of things that I could do to make our channel more successful because I care about you guys I hope that that is is totally obvious so basically I think that the main points of this video were that my kids are spoiled I'll give you that one. Gabby, Gabby thinks boyfriend. she knows everything. I'll give you that one. Gabby has a boyfriend. No. Sophie feels undervalued. You think that we're rich or you think that we're not rich? <laughs> one or the other. Think we're going to buy another house. And so many of you guys think that Penny is not right for me and that we're not going to keep our horses. I believe that if you're going to buy a horse that it, I believe that our pets are our family. And I believe that it hurts pets when they're resold. I don't know what God has planned, but in our hearts, we plan to keep them forever. Um, Until they die. Yeah. Our videos are not out there to try and confuse you, to try and make you think that we're different people than we are. We are just who we are, and I believe that you are only successful when you be who you are. Um, and that's why I don't edit out a lot of the times when Gabby is sassy or when Gabby doesn't feel like being in the video or when Sophie's goofy or when she's whining or complaining. Like, <laughs> all people have their things and these are our things and this is who we are. And I appreciate the fact that so many of you guys follow along and watch us. And I think possibly... You got I, the good lighting. I got the pale lighting. You do got the good lighting. <laughs> no, this is the tan lighting. This is the pale lighting. I like um, the pale lighting better. Mom, I anyway, me some champagne. I, I feel, tan too easily. Being okay. The sun makes me tan. Okay. I feel like I could be better at explaining things to you guys so that you don't have so many miscommunicated opinions about us. Like the fact that you think that Gabby and Sophie rule the roost. And that I have a boyfriend. And that she has a boyfriend. Like, you guys don't know Sam. You never let her have a boyfriend. Anyway, and that is it for this video. I hope you guys liked it. Or maybe. I don't even will. know if I'm going to post it because it got kind of crazy there in the middle. But anyway, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for being a part of our lives. It means a lot. It really, it means the world to all of us. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Bye. Don't you know that you're beautiful? Just the way.